Hello anyone and everyone, I am Echo, and today we're exploring Amnesia, The Dark Descent. We are here in the Transept, which is still a very cool looking area. Not sure why it has to be so absurdly big. There doesn't seem to be much going on in this room, but I guess Alexander just likes spacious places. Oh well. We've got one more room to go in over here. It's likely to be another torture room, where I hope we will find the third piece of the... Where is it? Grip the channel's wire. Yeah. Third piece of the tonic, which is the vitae, which we get from an agonized victim's blood. And also the sixth piece of orb. I assume there's just going to be six because we've only seen six torture rooms. Okay. Great. Very comfortable. Oh, hey! This is the saw. Okay, great. What's that? The rapist hanged upside down, his tears soiled with blood flooding from his belly. The saw between his legs had lodged itself in the hip and wouldn't move any further. The men stepped back and waited for the victim to drain. Yeah. So this is another torture device, as you could probably guess. There's another tinder box. There's another piece of orb. The grate covers a drainage pipe. There you go. Drainage pipe filled with blood that they dripped out from the dude. So, uh, yeah. Over the last couple days, I actually ended up... Where's the glass jar? But we can fill this with blood. Blood can't be reached. Find a way to lower the vessel to collect the blood. Or is that just a memento telling us? Find something to help lower the glass jar into the blood of the transept torture room. Sure. Okay. Um, yeah, over the last few days, I uh, ended up actually looking up some old, like, medieval torture methods because my curiosity got the better of me. Um, and yes, this game was what sparked that curiosity. I also, just in general, like history, um, and that's one part of history I'd never paid attention to before, and uh, yeah, it turns out all the torture methods used in this game really used to exist. They really used to do this shit to people, and it's absolutely horrifying to think of. Um, fuck of tar. That thing, that thing, that thing. I don't think we could use that. We still haven't... We still haven't used this. You know what? I bet this goes in that room that was locked. It had, like, a, a gate in front of it that we couldn't open for some reason, and, uh... Even though it didn't actually have a lock on it. And, uh... It had some machines behind it. I bet this goes to them. But anyway, um... can probably... Combine string with this? Yeah, I figured. Seems pretty simple. Glass jar has a string tied around it. There you go. Awesome. Glass jar of blood. It's filled with blood. And we got us a piece of orb. Okay. Anything going to spawn on us? I sure hope not. All right. Six pieces of orb, jar of blood, poison gland for the fungi thingy majiggy, and bone covered in mucus. Awesome. Anything around here? Nope. Good. The house is creaking with anger. It doesn't like the fact that I found all the ore pieces, I bet. Alright. Nope. 
back to the nave. We'll go tell Agrippa the good news. The fear had begun to drown him again. He reached once more for the empty bottle of laudanum. In frustration, he smashed it against the bedpost. Well, why'd you go and do that? How do I combine the pieces? Do I just... Nope, can't add anything directly into the blood. The substance needs to be purified first. What? Oh, shit. Can't be combined by hand. According to the note, the tonic has to be made with care. Well, okay, yeah, sure. But, uh, I guess let me read the note again. Grip the channel's fire. Um, it's probably prepared well. Should suffice to contain it. Blah, blah, blah. Extract its contents with proper tools. Optimism, blah, blah, blah. Rescript without killing him. Wire told me to feed him a tonic made from a paralyzer, vitae, and tamter. Yeah, okay. Well, crap. How do I do this crap? And what's the bucket of tar for? A wooden bucket filled with sticky tar. I still don't know. Haven't seen any use for this. I don't suppose we want to stick the bone in there? Nope, didn't think so. Put the fungus in there. Nope, didn't think so. Okay. Can we purify the blood with the tar? Nope, okay. Well, uh. I see that all the old pieces you need. Yeah, no, okay. No right to ask anything of you. Then stop but if you asking me. Heart, stop talking or something. Yeesh, man. To all, there might still be a chance for you to save me. Please, my faith is in your hands. Mm hmm. Okay, buddy. Um, so that way, dead end, we've gotten all the ore pieces from over there, and the ingredients that we can, same with that direction, uh, that we still haven't, I see that all the ore we still haven't been able to get past this door up here. This leads to the laboratory. It won't budge, yep. Can we? Nope. I know I've probably already tried this, but I can't, for the life of me, remember. Tar. No? Yeah, okay. So we just can't open that. God dang it. Start losing sanity. Stay in the darkness too long. Oh well. Um, we still can't use this, of course, because it's not an actual thing. It's just... Yeah. Oh, it looks good there. You can, you can, you can stay. All right. So I have no idea where we are supposed to go then. I see that all the ore yes, I have all the ore pieces. Thank you. No right Thank you, Vire or Agrippa, whatever your name is. All right. Maybe out here, since there's those two rooms to the side that we still haven't done much with. Something died inside of him that day, watching that man slip away. Yeah, we've already read that one. Okay. Alright. Oh, hey! Oh, what? Sleep. What hit me? I only saw the one monster. Hazel spent all summer in bed. He used to read to her after helping father with his work. In his mind, he was like Shehrazad, and as long as he kept telling the story, she would not die. Oh! I do believe that was a scripted event, and I was supposed to be hit. Still weird that the monster hit me through the 
like, door, and from really far away. Unless there's another one behind me that I didn't notice. You had me worried. Quite frankly, I'm not sure what to do with you. I hold no grudge against you, Daniel. We are so very much the same, you and I. Did you really drink from the amnesia mixture? It does explain so much of your behavior. You never did finish what you set out to do. You talked about redemption, how you would face the orb's shadow and save our work and me. I will grant you another chance to redeem yourself. You can wait here and stop the shadow. Thank you, friend. Huh. Okay. Slight headache, so our stuff is at the same level, and we've... They didn't take away any of our items. If he wanted to stop us, he probably should have had his servants take away the pieces of orb. That might have been a, a good idea. Anyway, memento. The cell door is locked. Find another way out. Uh-huh. A grip of the dying man wants a specific tonic made to save him. One note speaks of a mixture made with three ingredients. A pedestal and chance also depression in it that could fit an orb. An orb is needed to enter the inner sanctum. It's shattered pieces lie scattered in torture rooms. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Um. Alright. So, another way out of the cell. Can we bend the bars? Hmm. Yeah. Door's locked. Let me look around. Doesn't seem to be any holes in the ground or anything. Hmm. Oh, hey. Awesome. I was trying to reach the ladder, but I guess this is even better. An iron bar. A rod of iron from the cell bars. Well, yeah, duh. But... <laughs> yeah, this is what I was trying to grab. I don't know if this is actually going to help. It is not loose enough. No need to waste more time on it. What if I hit it with the other iron bar? Nope. Okay, fine. Now I don't suppose the chair increases my... Hitting capacity. Nope, doesn't seem like it. Alright. Iron bar and this thing. No. Hammer and chisel. It is solid metal and in good shape. This is no use. Okay. Tar? I mean, I can't squeeze through here. I just tried that. But we can't... Hmm. Hmm. Are there any other, other loose bars? Oh, this one. But it's barely... Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> oh my. Okay. Alright. Yeah, that's still not going to do anything. But I'm... I'm wondering. Uh, maybe... Okay, let's pull this over. Alright. Push it over a little more. Probably get the bucket out of the way, actually. God damn it. Okay, back that way. Bucket. You move. Bed, you go this way. Please, Bed, cooperate. Alright, thank you. Thinking maybe if I... get some better leverage or something. Oh, shit, I'm standing on the stuff. Oh, well, hey, I can take the... Wait, can I actually use this for leverage? Hold up a second. Kind of like... No? I mean, this should be able to work. If this is real life, it'd work. Give us some more leverage to pull the bar off, but I guess not. 
What if we... Hold up. Hold up. No, no, no. Chair, you stay here. Chair, chair, damn it. Alright, bucket. You get right there. Chair. You need to cooperate with me. Alright. Let's, uh... Something like that. Sure. Alright, and bucket. You get right there, so I can jump up high enough. No, you freaking thing. I seriously don't know. Like. Like, we can't even touch this stuff. And we can't even interact with the door anymore. We don't have to do something with the. This stuff, do we? Hit it with the iron bar? No, didn't think so. Okay, so what's out there? I mean, I we can't reach anything out there to help us, but... Just in case, you know. Oh, hey, look, I'm sticking my head out the bars. That's nice. That's neat. Damn it, all the hell. What items do I have? Got the lantern, that thing, wooden crank, I think I already tried the wooden crank. Tar, orbs, pieces of the tonic, and an iron bar. <sighs> Boy. Oh, this stuff is growing more and more. Me no likey. Okay, um, shit, heads pounding, hands are shaking. I suppose I can banish you with my light, no, I didn't think so. Couldn't do that in the beginning of the game, wouldn't make sense to do it here, but thought it was worth a try. God damn, we can't interact with this, I, I mean, this is like, what the hell, this is stupid, this is extra stupid, or maybe I'm stupid. Maybe there's something I'm missing that's really super obvious. I mean, Alexander did tell me to wait here and stop the darkness, and obviously he was being sarcastic, because he doesn't expect me to stop the darkness. He expects the darkness to kill me. I guess this stuff is made by the darkness. But I don't think sitting here and waiting to be killed uh, is going to win me the game. I have no idea. God damn it. And why wouldn't jiggling with this eventually get it off? It doesn't make any sense. If it's that loose, you should be able to pull it off eventually. But I don't know. Okay. Uh. Shit. Okay. So, some bricks are loose, but can't be removed by hand. Yeah, this uh, probably needs to use the iron bar on this, right? Yeah, I figured. Okay. So, yeah, I was being dumb. I was looking at the wrong area. Um, apparently, what we needed to do... What the hell? Come on, thank you. Let's take that back. Pick up iron bar. Oh, what's this? What the hell? Oh! Oh! Okay. Oh, Daniel, you're stronger than you look. The blood. Use the blood for the ritual. Yep. That's what I'm planning on doing. Aw, oh, darkness, are you mad? You couldn't kill me because I didn't stay around long enough? Jerk. Um. But yeah, no, I figured... I was looking at the wrong place or something. Turns out there was a little crack in the wall. My bad. Oh well. Alright, what's around here? Place is awfully well lit. And I do like that. Note! Last prisoner note. There's little left to say. I write solely to prevent myself from revisiting the memories of these last few days. If I am fortunate, I will fall asleep and time will pass without effort. I've begun to wean myself out 
of my prison. When I first arrived, I felt like I was being buried inside a tomb, but now I feel the close walls comforting me. As long as I am in here, there is no pain. The walls protect me from the outside. I even laughed earlier as one of my wardens dropped a key down the pipes. It gave me hope for a second, thinking I could escape if only I could somehow reach it from here. In my dreams, Alexander, I am king. In my dreams, I best you and escape your clutches and return with all the knights of the realm carrying pistols and sabers. In my dreams. Okay. One person sort of snapped, at least slightly, and... What the hell? What? Huh? Okay, there's a dead dude. There's some... There's a tinderbox. My sanity seems to be the same. That was weird. I guess we had a bit of a flashback to whatever happened here happening. I didn't take damage, did I? Ah, I did! You cut some bruises, you damn thing. Oh well. Could have been worse. Oh! Oh, probably need the... Probably better to do that with the crank. Okay. Nothing on the rope. Awesome. What if we... Huh. Do we put the blood here? Nope. Bucket of tar. Nope. Okay. Didn't think so. Well, I mean, kind of did think so, because I tried it, but I mean... I was only trying it because it seemed like something that might theoretically maybe work. Wooden bucket. Oh, okay. That's probably what'll work. And let me guess, this door's locked. Yep. Okay. So let's try putting the wooden bucket on here. It is empty. Yes. Lower that down. Ah. Huh. Sounds like we hit something. Pull it back up. What's going to be in the bucket? Bucket of water. Just water? Really? Okay. Cool. And these pipes. These look suspicious. There's a key in the pipe, but it can't be reached. Oh, hey, the guy in the cell even said at one point they dropped a key through the pipe. Kind of random that they do that, but oh well. Hammer and chisel? It would only ruin it. Oh, it ruined the hammer and chisel, I guess it means. Iron bar. Oh! Oh no, it's stuck in its position. Rusty key. Awesome. And the rusty key goes to this, I'm gonna guess. An unmarked key. Wow, my inventory's almost full. I bet that's not actually possible. They probably... Cool. Yeah, I bet they probably uh, carefully calculated what the maximum possible amount of items is to have at any one time and made it so your inventory isn't too low that you can ever run into a problem of not being able to pick up something. Because that would be super lame. Also, what's probably going to be super lame? Ah, a slight headache. Cool, my inventory, my uh, sanity went up a little bit. Probably because I solved the puzzle. But I'm going to have to end the episode here because I'm out of time, unfortunately. So I will see you all next time. I hope you have enjoyed it. And there's a key in the pipe, but it can't be reached. No, there's no key in the pipe. I already got the key out. Lying thing. Yeah, I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.